Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make rice noodles. It's made out of rice, so basically it's gluten free. So if you guys are allergic to gluten, this is perfect for that. Mm, for a lettuce wrap, so basically you put lettuce in there, some meat or veggie or tofu, and then you roll it like an egg roll and you eat it raw just like that. Or you can cut them up into the noodle size. You can have a flat big noodle or you can make it skinny noodle, whatever you like. You can modify the way you like. Um, there's, there are some of Thai dishes using this noodle. That's my son, sorry about that. One would be the drunken noodle. Drunken noodle basically is flat rice noodle that um, come with the chili sauce and Thai basil. You can do um, a pad seal, which is basically a flat rice noodle with Chinese broccoli and soy sauce. Or you can do ladna, which is a flat rice noodle with gravy sauce and some veggies. But today, I'm going to show you the easy way to make this noodle. And the next video would be a video of me using this flat noodle to make a lettuce wrap. And should be another video right after that would be a dish, which is my husband's favorite, favorite Thai dish. All right, let's go watch the video. One cup of rice flour half cup of tapioca flour, uh, half teaspoon of salt, and then the water, which is one and a half cup of water. Now you add water slowly, gradually, and then you stir them slowly. Um, keep doing it until it mix well. Yep, just keep stirring it. Then we're gonna add more water. Make sure there's no lump in the mixture. This is gonna take a while. You can strain it with the strainer if you want to. After all the ingredients are combined, set it aside for 15 minutes and then we go prepare the steamer by adding water. You brush oil onto the cake pan and then you add the mixture into the pan. You would use about a quarter cup of the mixture for one batch. Then you're gonna transfer it to the steamer. Make sure it's set evenly. Put the lid on and wait for one hour, I mean, I'm sorry, one minute and a half to two minutes. Make sure the, sh the, the sheet, the rice is cooked. And then you set it aside, you brush with the oil again on the top and let it cool down and start peeling it by using the butter knife. It should come out easily. This is the final product. Stretchy, gooey, and thin texture. This is how we like it. Thank you for watching. If there's a comment, please leave them below in the comment section. Um, if you like it, please hit a thumbs up for me, please. And see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye. See you later.